he did get the best, but not from Jada, because per Will Smith's own words, that him and Jada were pretty much humping all over the world. They were traveling constantly from the time, the first three months they were together all over the world. So Tupac did get some great support, I imagine, from his wife who moved closer to be with him and visited him every day. We all had this fucking hat from Poetic Justice, walking around looking like newsies, slinging newspaper about the Great Depression and FDR. And we're all just sitting here watching Jada spout these lies being like, do you think no one remembers? Because we all remember. Pepperidge Farm remembers Jada. I don't think she lied. I, I actually don't think Jada's lying. I, you know, now, and i seen somebody send a donation. Zuri phrase it. Thank you. I'm going to read it. Pac's cousin confirmed a few months ago that Pac tried to propose. Pac was cheating on Keisha with multiple women. Um, he says, it's confirmed. Jada tried to get bail money for Pac. She's annoying, but she doesn't, doesn't need to lie about that. I think Pac probably did propose. But I think what's kind of clear is that Pac had multiple women. And his, his proposal to Jada didn't mean shit. Probably the best way to try to get him to be loyal to you when you're in a place that you can't help is overcommit. Jada was fucking with Pac, but she was one of the sides. You weren't the main course, all right? Don't act like you were playing such an intricate part, but you were a side. He was telling you the same shit he was telling a lot of other women. This is a takeaway from me about this whole thing with um, Jada. Now,